Hi y'all, my name is Jean and the name of my channel is Jean Home Decor and More. Welcome if you are new and welcome back if you have stopped back by my channel to check out what I'm up to. So today you guys, I have a small haul, just a really small haul. It's a small haul of this or that. I've seen other channels with this or that hauls, that's what I call them, this or that. So I thought I would jump on the bandwagon and do a this or that haul. So stay tuned, check out what I have. All right, the first um, item that I'm gonna bring to you is, um, let me start off with this one. I got this, uh, okay, this is April. I wanna say I got this in February. I did a walkthrough of Big Lots. And look at this, isn't this cute? This is a plant stand and um, Big Lots had these and they had a lot of plant stands um, in their inventory and I expect that they still do. This is, the company is Real Living. You see that? And this was $14.99 at Big Lots. But I thought this was so cute and it has a little welcome sign on it. So I'm going to put this in the corner um, on my deck. And I think I'm going to put some begonias on this. I really I like impatience, but when that wind blows, those petals just kind of blow all over the place. And I don't want to keep going out there sweeping every other day. So I'm going to do begonias. I think they're pretty as well. So um, I'm going to put um, this out on my deck. Okay, so that's that item. Then, the next item that I purchased is from the Christmas tree shop. I bought this earlier today. And boy, do I need this because the last one I had like this, it cracked. So this was $5.99 at the Christmas tree shop. And I don't think Christmas tree shops are everywhere, but if you have one near you, um, they have really great items. As a matter of fact, after this video, I'm going to post a walkthrough because I videoed while I'm, while I was in there. Oh my goodness. They have so many nice things in the Christmas tree shop, but you know, I'm trying to, trying to keep things, you know, keep the spending to a minimum, I'm trying to be a minimalist when it comes to spending. But you know, I try to really stick with things that I really need. And I try to buy things, um, and I know this is, I try to buy items where I spend most of my time. And to be honest with you guys, I spend most of my time indoors. I'm not an outdoor person. So like I'll sit out there on the deck. I have a deck up high and a patio down low. I, I don't think I have ever sat out on the patio ever, maybe like for five minutes. We had a little a mini pool out there for the babies when they were little. I sat out there in that little pool, you know, sat out there on the chairs while they splashed around in the pool. Uh, you know, probably that's about the most time I've ever spent out down on the patio. On the deck, I sit out there maybe, like if we have company, I might sit out there for an hour. You know, my husband put citronella out, but you know, you still get... You know, um, you still got to watch, you know, because you need to put that Avon, whatever that stuff is that you put on. So you the repellent for mosquitoes. So, you know, mosquitoes, flies, bees. Uh, uh. So I don't really sit out there on the back that much. But anyway, to water my plants, I got this. But speaking of sitting out there on the back, you know, I'm going to try to do a little bit better with sitting out there. Now we do entertain in the summertime. We do have friends over, but believe it or not, and I don't encourage anybody to do that, but you know, when other people come over, it seems like they'll sit out there for a little while, but they eventually come back in. Not because it's not nice to sit outside, but it's just that with global warming, it's so hot. You know, people want to come inside. They'll sit out there for a little while, but eventually people will end up back inside. Or they'll go down in my basement because they, you know, we have a pool table, a card table down there and so forth. So they'll usually end up, you know, it's like if we have a cookout, they might be out on the deck 
inside or down the basement. But a lot of times, like I say, you know, people end up back inside. But in any event, I'm going to try to spend a little bit more time out there decorating. So having said all of this, I don't do a lot of decorating on the deck or the patio because I don't spend a lot of time out there. But I did, I'm trying to make, a, you know, more of an effort. So having said that, at the Christmas tree shop, I picked these mats up. These were a $1.99. I don't know if you can see that. They were $1.99 at the Christmas tree shop. And let's see what else I got from there. Then I got these little plastic plates. I only got four. I only got four because really, to be honest with you, this will be for a small setting. Maybe my husband and I and my daughter and her husband. If the setting, if the company becomes, it goes beyond that, I use paper plates, guys. I'm not even going to lie. I use paper plates. So these were $1.69. But I thought that these were really nice. So I thought that I would do something like this on a table. I'm going to do something like this. So I thought if when I do decide to put a little outdoor decor outside for place settings, this is what I'll do. And I'll have some type of nice um, napkin and everything and some plastic cutlery. Now I do have some really nice um, summer pitchers, you know, for iced tea or mint tea, you know, um, margaritas, whatever, you know. So, but any of it, I thought I would try to do something a little bit, you know, more decorative, you know, for, for outdoors. So that's what I got, you know, at the Christmas tree shop. And I thought that was pretty reasonable. And like I said, I'm not going to spend a lot of money, you know, for outdoor decoration because I don't spend that much time out there. But in any event, I'm making an attempt. I'm making an attempt. All right. The other thing that I got, let's see what's next. The other thing that I got, I've then moved on to Target. So the other thing that I got, I... I've seen these round pillows and I really wanted one of these round pillows and this one is so nice and plush and soft. So this was $20 um, at Target. This little toss pillow. So I might um, put this here in my living room because I, you know, I just got some um, Decanovo white drapes, gourmet drapes or curtains, whatever you guys call them. Actually, I had to close them because it let so much light in. I wanted to be, I didn't want it to interfere with my video. That's why I'm not facing that direction. So, but I might put this in there or I might put this in my family room. So, but I thought this was really cute. So I got this from Target and this was $20. So, moving on, then, Here's where the this or that comes in. Then I got this Bona floor cleaner because it cleans and shines for these wood floors. I got method the last time and I just cleaned these floors last week. And my husband was like, why is the floor so sticky? But I don't know why because it wasn't in every area and I cleaned the floor really good. So I thought maybe this next time I would try Bona. Because we have the regular, we don't have the uh, new engineered wood floors. We have regular wood floors. Um, so I'm going to try this on that and see if this, you know, if it works better. You know, and hopefully I'll remember to let you know. Then the other thing that I got from Target. Oh, look at this. Look at this, you guys. I have a sundress. And what I, it has little spaghetti straps and it's high-waisted, which I think is very um, figure flattering. Okay, so it's high-waisted. But this is really, really nice. 
This is by A New Day. And this was, um, this was $30. Okay. And so you can see that's the bottom of it. And you can see the elastic, and that comes up under your um, breast area, which I think makes it really figure flattering. And um, it has a button in the back at the top with a little peephole here at the top in the back. So I'm going to, like I said, I'm going to visit my son in Texas in July. So I'm going to wear this one day when I'm out hanging out with my son and my family. So I thought that this would be really, really cute. You know, this is going to be really cute. And what I got to wear with these is look at these guys. Ooh. Look at these. They have a little bling on them. You see that? See that? These are really nice. These I got from Nordstrom's. And these are Sam Edelman. Now, usually, I, I usually look for bargains. But sometimes I'll just jump out the window if I see something I really like. And I'll just spend the money for them. So these weren't on sale. And I want to say these were, these were almost $100. I probably could have got them cheaper somewhere. But you know, like I saw them and I didn't want to wait and I didn't want to forget. So I just bought them and I thought these are going to be really sharp with my little sun dress. So that's what I got. And I'm going to wear these together and these go with so many things you know that's what i like about them they go you wear them with a dress all types of colors so you can't go wrong with a sandal like this and plus they're comfortable so that's that and then the other thing that i got now i did buy these these are so cute i wore and i should have thought to do a ootd but I didn't think about it. I wore these to church on Sunday. But these are really, really cute. They have the, you know, the clear at the top. I like the heel. It's not too high. And it's patent leather heel, square. But these are so cute. They look so sharp. I wore them with um, pants, like a kimono. And a, you know, like a shirt underneath, but it was dressy. I mean, it was dressy, but these are cute. So, of course, you can wear these with pants or, you know, any type of sundress. So, I plan to get plenty of use out of this this summer. And it has a square toe. And I like this because my feet are wide, you know. So, some people have narrow feet. They might not, I mean, they may not like these, but I have a wide foot. So, you know, the square toe shoes. They are really, they, these look nice on too. So these came from Kohl's, guys, and these were $39. And let's see who made these. That's who made these. T-O-R-G-E, accent E-I-S. That's who made these. And like I said, I got these from Kohl's. And they were about $39. So I, um, that's about it for the haul. I did get one other thing, one other thing. I, I couldn't resist these. So I got these, I had a taste for something, you know, like a snack, something kind of sweet and salty, savory. So this is um, dark chocolate, chocolatey drizzled popcorn. And I bought two bags from Target. These were $3.49. I already opened one bag and just to see what they tasted like. And they're really good. They're 160 calories with 9 grams of fat. So here it says it's 100 calories per cup, non-GMO, no artificial preservatives. So in any event, they say all that. It's still, you know, still fattening to some degree. So I, you know, I... I eat a little bit, but you know, I take a couple just to kind of satisfy that sweet 
and salty, you know, um, craving. And then I'll leave them up there. My husband will knock these off, but I got these. So you might want to try and they're really, really good. So that's it for my this or that haul. I hope you guys enjoy it enjoyed it look for my video on the christmas tree shop they have a lot i mean a lot of spring and summer um they have a lot of spring and summer products they have um products if you go to the you know items for if you go to the beach they have items for gardening they have indoor items items for your deck and patio the christmas tree shop has just about everything a lot of a lot of this or that they have just about everything um they have toys um they have makeup they sell food um they have kitchen items um linen items so i when i when you look at this next video i can't do everything because it's just too much to cover um, they even have, um, you know, um, items for, you know, gift bags and cards and all of that. But I captured some things that I thought would be of interest as we move into um, the summertime. We're going to, after Memorial Day and the kids get out of school, people will start vacationing. So people will be looking to set those pools up, going to, you know, going on vacation and getting in the pool or the ocean. But... If you have a Christmas tree shop near you, you might want to check them out. So look for that video. Thank you all, as always, for watching. If you like this video, please like. Give me a thumbs up. Um, comment. Let me know what you think about these items that I bought. If you have any questions. And please subscribe. I really do appreciate it. I really do. And I hope you guys have an amazing day. And I'll talk to you soon. Okay, bye-bye.